Raghan al-Hazali, a Stockholm-based Iraqi journalist, has been arrested on suspicion of spying by the Swedish police. They took the action as part of a series of moves made by security forces throughout Western Europe against other alleged Iranian-inspired conspiracies. Allegations are that al-Hazali had been targeting Awazi, an expatriate Iranian opposition group which has been subjected to numerous previous attacks at the hands of Iranian assassins. An Arab minority from Western Iran, the Awazi form a major part of the dissident group the Arab Struggle Movement for the Liberation of Avaz, ASMLA. They frequently suffer at the hands of Tehran's campaigns of murder and execution. In 2017, Ahmad Mola Nissi, at the time the ASMLA leader, was shot dead in the Netherlands. According to Dutch government sources, Iran paid local gangsters to commit the assassination. In October last year, a Norwegian of Iranian descent was arrested by Swedish police. They alleged he was part of a plot to kill another Copenhagen-based ASMLA leader. Swedish courts have ruled that Al-Hazali is held in pre-trial detention on suspicion of quote-unquote, serious illegal intelligence activities against an individual. Hannah Lindblom, Hazali's lawyer, said, All I can say is that he denies what the prosecutor says. I cannot say anything else because I am under a gag order. Prior to his arrest, Al-Hazali was the Stockholm correspondent of the Euro Times. First published in 2016, it has become a popular newspaper read throughout Europe. It is also alleged Al-Hazali made frequent visits to a Dutch television station with links to ASMLA. He convinced ASMLA he opposed the Iranian regime. However, they became suspicious when they discovered images of him with Iraqi militia unit Asir Ib al al huks leader Qais Hazali, a unit closely aligned to Tehran. An ASMLA source said he was asked, How are you able to travel there when you are against Iran? The same spokesperson added, he didn't have a very convincing answer. Al-Hazali is apparently of the same tribe as militia leader Qais Hazali, which may have allowed him some level of safety, but it's unlikely if he was known to have connections to ASMLA. ASMLA continue to spearhead a campaign to create a separate Arab state for the Awazi outside of Iran. Iran contends that the Awazi are terrorists and that ASMLA is in fact a terrorist organization, which they say has also carried out a campaign of bomb attacks within Iran.